everyone welcome to rainbow network media please kindly subscribe to this channel for interesting news thank you all for listening in yoruba land there are several people that inherited so much power from their forefathers but some of them are not recognized many people only know the likes of sunday boho because of his recent movement against fulani headsmen and insecurities in nigeria but there are dozens of powerful warlords like him in the southwest one of these warlords is awishe ogbone of undo this young man looks very calm but he is 40 fortified and committed member and a little holder of the Oboni uh, Aborigine Confraternity. He has recently joined the Odwa People's Congress in order to put hands together to flush all bandits that are raping, killing and abducting people in the Southwest. He is also a supporter of Sunday Boho. In a viral video yesterday, he was with some OPC members in the bush and they sent a message to the public. They said they have been inside the forest for the past three days trying to locate the bandit hideouts in the forest. They said they have cleared large parts of the forest and they have not seen any bandit hideout yet. He says that when they spot any bandits hanging in the forest, they will eliminate all of them. He says, every bandit in the Yoruba land, we are coming for you. We do not have AK-47, but we believe in the ancestral powers of Odua, and we will flush you out one after the other. See. There is no AKA for AK-47, but we will make the bandits cry in their own blood. We have been clearing this forest for the past three days, and we have not come across any bandits. But when we see them, we shall eliminate them. After clearing the bush, we are hi hiding. We are heading to Open State to help the fight against insecurity. He said they got information that some bandits were hiding in the forest and they have some tracing, they, they've been tracing them for days now. He says that the bandits are in trouble because they are fully prepared to trace all of them. They said they are law-abiding citizens, but they cannot allow the bandits to keep dominating their territory and perpetrating crimes. He says, by the time the strikes, people uh, will know that we are truly fortified. Uh, one of the OPC team members that apprehended the notorious Iskilu Wakili in Ibadan was also spotted among these warlords. The man says that, we are not scared of anyone because we are well fortified. If you are a bandit, be prepared to drink your pap with your blood. All these people are supporters of Sunday Boho and they are dedicated to bringing an end to every form of insecurity in the West. According to them, they have been invading forest for a while now in search for bandit hideout and they will eliminate any bandits they find in the forest. So guys, uh, I think the move that the uh, Odwa people are taking in order to secure their uh, environment is not uh, really bad. So guys, why do you think uh, each territory should be protected. Let's know your views and your thoughts concerning uh, this news by kindly dropping at the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more updates. Thank you all for listening.